New numbers emerging that show the sad and terrible toll of Australia's wildfire crisis. A professor at the University of Sydney estimates nearly half a billion animals have been killed by the bushfires that have torched three million hectares of New South Wales alone. In a statement regarding how he reached the massive figure, Professor Chris Dickman explains it was founded on a report he co-wrote in 2007 for the World Wild Fund for Nature. It studied the impacts of land clearing on the state's wildlife and obtained estimates on the population density of mammals in the state. He's now multiplied that by the amount of land hit by the fires. While the number is just an estimate, the statement says many of the affected animals are likely to have been killed directly by the fires, with others succumbing later because of a lack of food or shelter. It adds the true loss of animal life is likely to be much higher than 480 million. NSW's wildlife is seriously threatened. Australians faced another dangerous day Saturday as the wildfire threat rises. We're in for a long night and uh, we're, we're, we've still yet to hit the worst of it. Temperatures are reaching the high 40s and strong winds could push flames toward more populated areas, widening the path of destruction. We are now in a position where we're saying to people it is not safe to move, it is not safe to leave these areas. Thousands of koalas are feared dead in Australia's wildfires, with the country's environment minister saying 30% of their habitat has been wiped out in New South Wales. And as the wildfires continue to rage, two more people have died, bringing the death toll to 23. For City News, I'm Karen Seolin.